Hi, I'm Steve from Foiling Magazine here at AWSI with Ocean Rodeo and Jill. And uh, Jill, there's so much innovation going on at Ocean Rodeo. I, was, I really loved last night's presentation from Richard. And so uh, there's so much cooking, uh, but maybe we could just start with what's going on right now. I think the, the current thing that I'm excited about is actually your seven meter Alula glide. So you want to tell me a little bit about that wing and, and uh, you know, what's going on there and then what's coming with, I see what's in your hands. in your hands. Yeah, absolutely. Thank you, Steve. So the seven meter glide is a really exciting addition to our A-series glide lineup. It's only available in an Alula airframe. And the thought there, the reason it took us a little bit longer to come up with a seven meter, as opposed to most other brands had already come out with that. Um, we were a little late to the game. And the reason for that was that we wanted our wingspan to be appropriate for riding, not catching the wingtip and that was really taken into consideration. So the, the wingspan is really interesting on our seven meter. Yeah, I've ridden both the seven and the meter. six and the, it's a totally different shaped wing. You know, the six yes. and the seven in the series, it's not like you just took one wing and just blew it up and made it smaller. It's the seven is totally designed differently than the six. Exactly. I would even say that the six has like exceptional high end and the seven has exceptional low end. If that's, I don't know if that's the, was the design idea, but yes. as a guy that rides seven meter <laughs> kites, you know, like I can tell, so yeah. And that's that's something I, I don't often ride a seven meter, right? Yeah. Um, but that's another exciting addition is we've actually come out with a 2.5 as well, uh, which is a little bit more appropriate right, right. for my usual riding. And, but the seven meter for a lot of people is the difference between a session or not a session. Absolutely, absolutely. For me, for me at 110 kilos, it is actually. So, <laughs> but, so I've been riding it with the soft handles, but I see, uh, and these have been a bit in development as well because I've been asking about them. Oh, they're coming, they're coming. And so now, now they're here, is that right? That's right. So we started off with the soft handles and something that we've come up with that is really cool is we now have a full carbon boom option and so this would be we it comes in a 94 centimeter or 110 centimeter option depending on the size of wing you're riding and uh, it's customizable so the really neat thing about this is that i can actually switch handles on the same wing so the boom is really great for a lot of uh, x wind surfers for example yeah have been really asking about getting a, a full boom option. You can have your hands anywhere for riding. But even, even your great. world tour team rider, not just old windsurfers, but Absolutely. Like he's riding this boom, isn't he? Absolutely, and it's it's a bit of personal preference and he, he enjoys it. Um, again, yeah, just being able to put your hands anywhere on the wing, there's a lot of talk about, oh, this wing is better because the handle placement is here and that really eliminates that. So yeah, that's a great absolutely. thing. It is still very, very light. It's quite impressive how light this is. And that's the carbon really helps. We've kept it pretty affordable. It's pretty comparable to other wing handles on the market. So. Awesome. And so when, when are these actually available in stores and such? Uh, these are shipping to stores as we speak. Okay, fantastic. Great, yes. great to hear. So there is a, there's quite a lineup for them. It took us a while to get them out on the market. So there is a bit of a lineup, but Anybody that's pre-ordered will be very happy very soon. Awesome. And uh, just one last thing for you here. Uh, in last night's presentation at Wind Dance, uh, you know, Richard was talking about all kinds of new material, new material ideas for Alula. And uh, then he showed like some prototype wings that are coming down the line. Can you share any secrets of, uh, with, the, with the rest of the world on, on what might be coming in materials? Because it was pretty exciting stuff. I, I know it's not coming out tomorrow. <laughs> But, um, you know. Absolutely, yes. We have some new concept wings. They're concept wings now, but they've been tested and tried for many years, uh, these, material these new materials coming out. And I can tell you it'll be light lighter, it'll be stronger, and um, we've done a few things to improve them. So some of these wings will be more for your average rider. Some of them will be for somebody who's uh, looking for a really, really high performance wing, and we're pretty excited about about seeing more of that happening. Awesome, yeah, well, I was I was super impressed. I didn't know that uh, like Ocean Rodeo was so into materials and so into 
pushing the limits of, of weight and strength and, until last night. And so that was really exciting to learn. Well, thanks so much, Jill, on giving us the lowdown on what's coming from Ocean Rodeo. I appreciate Thank it. Thank you. Thank you, Steve. Absolutely.